Sunny Wonani guys and welcome to another video. So in this video we'll be talking about uh, Mac G saying that his woman has said no to marrying him not once but two times. So Mac G um, and the podcast were on a brunch in Broomfontein and one of the chillers actually asked um asked him when he plans on getting married like is there any plans are there any plans you know on the pipeline what's going on is he planning on getting married anytime soon and his response was that he has tried to marry his woman two times and she has said no both times now i'll play the recording um i'll play like the voiceover from that um because i don't think i can play the um the actual um video for reasons <laughs> on youtube so um i'll play you guys the video and then i'll tell you what i think about it after So yes guys, as you heard, he's asked his woman to marry him two times and she said no both times. Now honestly, in my opinion, he said Nayaguti, he was trying to take the like the cowardly way out. He was trying to take the easy way out. If you don't know, Meiji and his woman um have a son, like an older son. So I think maybe it's possible that the first time he sent his uncles to her family, maybe it was because um she was pregnant. And then the uncles were like, oh, we'll pay damages. And then, you know, we'll also want to pay Lobola. And she probably said no. And second time, here's what I don't understand. How do you send uncles over to your woman's home without talking to her or like hearing where she is? Like, is she going to say yes? Is she going to say no? Because if she says no when the uncle's already there, that means you do not ask her. But it was just the two of you guys and you're just honestly embarrassing yourself because <laughs> she's saying no. Like, if he did not hear the first time, why would he try to like do it again the second time? Also, it's possible that the second time was when, because if you don't know, Mick G has a daughter with his baby mama. So they have two children together now. It's possible that the second time that he um, actually asked for her to marry him through his uncles was probably when they were paying damages for the second child. And then they were like, should we pay Lobola now? And she said, no, here's my opinion. Now, lady was right for saying no, because why? One, you're not going to take the easy way out. If you want to marry me, you're going to ask me, like, nicely, nicely to marry you. Not just send your uncles to my place. Um, so that's one thing. I think she was right for saying no both times. And honestly, like, we're old, we're adults. So if you want my hand in marriage, you're going to talk to me because it's me you want to marry. Before you send your uncles and stuff like that, you talk to me, we talk to each other. Are we ready for marriage? Are we ready for taking the next step and stuff like that? So she was well in her rights to say no to um, marrying the guy when he hadn't even asked her and just sent, you know, his uncles to her place but um what do you think ladies what would you say if you had no idea your guy was going to you know ask for hand in marriage and you just see his uncles by the gate during the zitagazelos and they're like we are asking for your hand in marriage would you say yes and guys would you just send <laughs> your uncles to your lady's place without talking to her about it like 
I still don't understand how that happens. But um, yeah, that's my take on it. Share your views on what you think about this in the comment section below. And yeah, that is it for this video. Until next time.